You explain things you feel in advance of them happening as coincidence or something more profound. Researchers believe we, as humans, are connected through a shared consciousness. As a society, we are trained to ignore our intuition. It's this attitude that has led to us letting our psychic abilities waste away instead of working to try and develop our psychic potential. The truth is, everyone can work on developing and honing the natural psychic skills we possess. Here are six ways to tap into your natural psychic ability. 1. Meditate. Meditation and the necessity to connect to our inner wisdom are essential. Meditation can be scary. But the realization that there is no right or wrong way to do it should help. Meditation is helpful in connecting to our psychic abilities through a relaxed and focused mind. If we can do that, then we are meditating. As we focus our mind on the now, we connect to our information center, commonly known as our soul. And it's through this connection to our higher self that we are introduced to our spiritual energy. As we begin to see this energy, we are opening the doors to psychic encounters. To spend more time in nature. The connection and bond we form with Mother Nature, in all of her glory, will help strengthen our connection to our higher selves. The earth is all around us, above, below and even inside us. We sometimes overlook that Mother Nature is responsible who we are, and it's important to realize she is more than the environment we live in. It's this awareness that allows us to develop a relationship with Mother Nature. Treating her with respect and understanding that there is an aspect of our higher self that resides in her core, will allow us to tap into our full potential. We become more attuned to our surroundings, both externally and internally. 3. Overcome the fear. We are all spiritual and intuitive beings and as we bring awareness to this fact something in us shifts. Instead of ignoring the little voice in our head, we start paying attention to it and even asking it for guidance. This can be a scary process at first, and our fears can keep us from completing the journey. Our intuition is a natural thing, and it deserves to be honored not feared. If you want to develop your psychic abilities, you can't be afraid of what will happen when you do. Put trust in your higher self that it always has your best interests at heart. Just keep focused on the good that developing this ability will do, and it might not be so fearful in the end. 4. Observe and listen. Before you speak, it is necessary for you to listen, for God speaks in the silence of the heart. Mother Teresa. Are you observing through sight or maybe through sound? The more we can observe and listen using all of our senses, the more connected to our inner source we will be. Using all of our senses will enlighten us to the truth and empower us to understand things on a higher level. It is the ability to use all of our senses that opens the mind to processing higher levels of vibration. 5. Believe. We have to believe. Truly believe in ourselves and the ability to awaken our psychic abilities that have been dormant for far too long. Psychic abilities are present in people who have earned them and who deserve them. We must develop our abilities with the purest of intentions. As we begin to realize our psychic potential, be intentional with how it is used. We must commit to being resolute to use our gifts in service of others and for the highest good of all who we touch. 6. Practice. Just like any skill or ability you are looking to develop, practice is an important ingredient to ensure an evolving spiritual connectedness. Make sure and take your practice with you, the more you can tune into your higher self the more connection you will feel. It is through this connection that our psychic abilities would thrive. It probably won't happen overnight, so be prepared to practice and then practice some more. Russell Stewart mentioned the following bit of wisdom in an article at Psychic Journal. He said, It takes time for the subconscious to be able to communicate with the conscious mind. And the best way to do this is to start simply thinking about it. All these thoughts have a positive effect on developing your gift. Read about the subject. Knowledge will help, as you need some understanding of how things work. Adopt the policy you would take with a new hobby. Become involved in it, buy books and magazines, and look for more information on the internet. Have you tapped into your psychic abilities? Share your story.